Ladies and gentlemen, you are looking at what, in the 1960s, the US Army tried to develop into a multi-purpose, all-terrain military vehicle. In fact, they took it to the Nevada desert to see if it could cope with sand. Sadly, it could not. So, what about um, mud? OK, well, could it deal with rocks, even if they were small ones? In a word, no. In fact, unless the conflict involved running over unarmed foot soldiers on perfectly smooth tarmac, it was completely useless. However, over in Australia, advertisers had recognised the true potential of the moak and were busy selling it as a funster. Wow! Meet BMZ Mini Moke! Just look at that! Hey, look at this driver treated rough! Mini Moke is on display now. Just an incredible $1,295 plus delivery. Anyway, here we are, 30 years on, and thanks to production line in Portugal, the Moke, once again, is available in Britain. one litre engine, though there's an injection Cooper version coming later. And if you like driving minis, and let's face it, who doesn't? You're just going to love this. It's alfresco fun in an anodyne world. So, will it sell? There are, I think, three things which will see the moat through. One, in towns where it's at its best, congestion is so bad, nobody ever goes faster than 10 miles an hour. Two, the global warming has reached such a point that people now go sunbathing in March. And three, well, it only costs six grand.